Hello friends, in this video we will show the first glimpse of Friends Forever. Friends Forever is a simple, basic social networking website which covers the basic functionalities and features. So we will walk through the application showing each feature in detail. So let's start with the register form. So this is the register form of the Friends Forever. It has basic fields in the form and the register form asks user to enter the details so that the user can register to the application and after registering the user can log in to the application and then perform various operations so these are the fields and this is the register button and on click of this button the user will be registered to the application so if i click this button so there is a functionality that is validation being applied it says that all the fields in the register form are mandatory you have to fill the user has to fill these details so let's create our first user so the first user we have is Leo my last name is Messi and my username is Leo underscore one one and my password is Messi and I click on register so the Leo is registered to the application now let's see the login whether so we, I say leo underscore one one and my password is messy so you can see I am able to log into the application so this is about the register form let's move to the next part that is login so we just saw like the register form we also have a login form wherein we ask user to enter the username and password and click on the login button so we'll log in through the Leo Messi user. Just we we just created. My password is Messi, and I click on login. So this is the home page, which is common to all the users. This is the first page the user see after logging into the application. So let's move to the next part, that is profile picture. Now profile picture is an important feature in the social networking website. So your photo or your picture is the first impression it gives the first impression to the other user or to your friends so basically currently the this user doesn't have any picture uploaded so we are showing a default picture which says photo unavailable and there's a link at the top of this picture saying upload image so when you click on this picture a pop-up opens a dialog box opens now this dialog box asks the user to choose file from his desktop machine so we have images here so my user is Leo Messi so I am uploading I have choose the Messi image and I am going to click upload once you click on upload upload the image is uploaded to the database and the profile picture is set for the user so this is about the profile picture in the application so the next part is add friend now in order to add a friend you need to search people and in order to search people you need to have multiple users now the currently our application only has one user that is Leo Messi so let's add one more user so in order to add one more user I have to redirect to the register page so my second user is Mezut my last name is Ozil my username is Mezut underscore 22 and my password is Ozil and I'm clicking on register so Mezut Ozil also register to the application now I'm going to log in through Mezutozel so Mezut underscore 22 is my username and Ozil is my password so I'm logging into the application using Mezut now I'm going to upload profile picture for Mezut as well so we have profile picture for Mezut so you can see we have uploaded the profile picture for Ozil so now in order to add Leo Messi as my friend I have to search Leo Messi so you can see as soon as I type Leo Leo Messi appeared in the search box so on clicking the Leo Messi I go to the Leo Messi's profile where it shows the basic information like about which has name currently we are not tracking DOB and location so you will see only name and email we also track Leo Messi's friends we also track mutual friends and suggestions we will see further what these mutual friends and suggestions indicates and if you have noticed you have a button here that is add as friend so when you click on this button a friend request will be sent to Leo Messi 
and when Messi will log into the application, he will see a friend request being sent by Mesut Ozil. So let's log out of the application and log in through Leo Messi. So Leo underscore one one, and I've logged in through Leo Messi. So now you can see there's an image and there's a notification that is there's a counter one which shows you have one friend request from any of the user. So when you click on this image, a pop-up opens and it shows Mesut Ozil has sent you a friend request. So there's a two option for Leo Messi, either to accept the request or to reject the request. So I'm going to accept it. So I accept the request and I close the pop-up. So you can see there's a counter being increased here. And now both of these are friends. So let's, this is about how to add user as a friend. You, have, you need to search the user from the search box and then you can add as a friend so so that a friend request will be sent to the user and once the user accepts the friend request you both will be the friends the next part is the friend list friend list is basically maintaining the friends you have so basically this is the counter which maintains a friend list currently you have Leo Messi has a single friend so when you click on this counter a pop-up opens which shows Mesut Ozil is your current friend so this is how the friend list is maintained and it's quite easy for user to see his friend and his friend list and friend count as well so let's move to the next next part that is friend details now these friend details is basically the same page we searched earlier so let's search Mesut so these are the details now currently Mesut has only single friend that is Leo Messi so these are the friend details we are referring to. Currently we are tracking very less information. We'll be tracking more information in future versions. The next part is the post part. So this is very important part. Now there's one more tricky thing here. You can go to home page by clicking on this home link or either you can click on this image to go to the home page. So currently Leo Messi is the logged in user. Now there's a there's a text area being provided which says share your thoughts so any logged in user can share his thoughts by writing text into this so let me write hello everyone and I click on post so as soon as you click on post post will be created on the page and this post is seen by all the friends so in order to check that let's log out of the application and I'm going to log in through Mesut and my password is Ozil so you can see the Leo Messi's post is seen on wall of Mesut Ozil so this is how if any user post any data or any comment that will be seen by all of his friends so this is about post let's move to the next part that is comment that is commenting on any post now currently this is the post being posted by Leo Messi so I'm going to comment on this post you can see there's a comment link so when you click on this comment a pop-up appears so this pop-up ask user the logged in user to post a comment so I say hi Messi I'm doing fine and I'm going to click on comment so this adds a comment to the post and I close the pop-up so you can see there's an automatic increase increment in the counter so when you click on this counter you can check your comment and you can delete your comment as well you can see a cross sign here so on clicking on this you can delete your comment as well so now I'm closing this pop-up so now if I log out of the application so, so I'm logging again through Leo Messi So you can see even Messi could see that counter and he can check if anybody has commented on his post or not. Now I am closing this pop-up. Now let's move to the next part. The next part is like. So in order to check like, let me log in through Mesut. So now as we know the Leo Messi has posted hello everyone to all his friends now I want to like this post so there's a link I'm going to click on this link so you can see there's a counter increase here 
which says you have liked this post so currently i am the logged in i am the logged in user so it's showing me you so if i logged out of this application and log in through leo it will show me the name of the friend who has liked that is mezu tozal so this is how like works like and comment works in this version we are not supporting share will be supporting in our next versions next part is the notifications now notification plays very important role it keeps you track of the events happening people or friends who are commenting or liking your comments or your post so right now messi has three notifications which is saying mezu tozel added you as a friend mezu tozel commented on a post like we just commented few minutes back mezu tozel liked your post so this is about the notifications now currently it is on clicking this image it gives a pop up and the notifications are listed in this pop up in the descending order so when you close it close the pop up and you refresh any time the page refreshes the image will go saying that you have checked the notifications anyway if you click on this image it will show you the notifications but that means you have already checked your notifications if there is no counter over the earth image so this is about the notifications a mutual friends now to demonstrate the mutual friends i have to create my third user so let's log out of the application and go to the register form and let me add a new user saying santi my santi underscore three three and my password will be kazola now santi is also registered to the application and i'm going to login through santi so now from santi let's first upload image for santi otherwise santi will feel bad there's no image for me so i'm uploading the image for santi so santi also has his dp which looks quite smart now i'm going to search leo and mezud both and add them as a friend so i have added leo as my friend and also mezud as my friend now i'm going to log in using both of these leo and mezud to accept the friend request of so you can see there's one notification that is santi kazola added you as a friend and there's one more notification saying you have got a friend request from santi so i'm accepting it and i'm closing it now i'm going to log out now i'm going to log in through mezut and you can see the same one notification there are two notifications basically leo accepted the friend request and santi added you as a friend and i'm going to accept it again so now santi is friend of mezut as well as leo so what happens now if i search leo here i'll i'm going to see the details of leo messi so what it shows it shows leo has two friends that is mezut and santi and there is one mutual friends between the logged in user which is the mezut and the searched user that, that is the messi and that is santi so this is about the mutual friend that means the friend common between the logged in user and the searched user so this is how we are maintaining the mutual friends let's move to the next part that is friend suggestion now friend suggestion is basically the friend who is friend of the friend of the user who is searched but not friend of the logged in user so in order to do that in order to demonstrate that let me register one more user that is eden Hazard and my username will be Eden underscore four four. Password will be Hazard. And I'm going to log in through Eden. So now let's upload image for Eden as well as we did for all the three users. you can see the display pic for eden now i'm going to add leo as my friend but not mezut so 
so i am adding leo as my friend i am logging out of the application i am logging through leo and accepting friend request of eden so and i am logging out of the application and again logging through mezoth so now eden is Eden is Leo's friend, but not Mezudozil's friend. So now I'm searching Leo here. So I'm going to Leo's profile. So it it says Leo has three friends. That is Mezud, Sandy, and Eden. There's one mutual friend that is Sandy, and there is a suggestion for Mezud. That is you can add Eden Hazard as your friend, who is friend to Leo Messi. So this is basically the suggestion. And you can also click on this name to go to Eden's profile. Now, so next is unfriend, which is the last feature we have supported. So now in unfriend, what you can do? So there's a two options from two places you can unfriend a friend. Now here is a button. So when you click on this button, you can unfriend your friend. So what happens? So there's let's see the other place from where you can do. now leo messi see now you can the place the, from where you have added the friend you can also unfriend that user now i'm going to click unfriend so what happens now this leo messi is no more friend of mezu tozel so if i go to the home page there will be no post as now messi is not friend of mezu the mezu will not be seeing any post from leo messi and mezu has only one friend that is sandy casola so this is about the unfriend feature we have now across the application we have to provide the connectivity we have created links like in the friend list you can go to anybody any users profile by clicking the name that is i can go to eden hazards now if you check here friend i can go to leo messi's profile and if i check in mutual friends i can go to santi cozola's profile so basically to give the connectivity we have created links all over the application so that the logged in user can go to anybody's profile even clicking on here you can go to that profile so this is how the connectivity is maintained across the application so this is all about friends forever and we have we have captured basic functionalities of a social networking website in this application we'll try to capture more and more features in the upcoming versions i hope you enjoyed this video and please comment your suggestions on this application thank you friends